Hey everyone, um, I know it's been a while but surprise I've moved countries and this is the vlog kind of documenting that and all the processes of moving country during a pandemic and trying to find a place to live in Brighton. So we've moved to Brighton, surprise, and um, we're currently staying at my in-laws house here and we're just trying to find a flat for us that is cheapish um, because we want to try and buy a house in the distant future um, but we both need to find a flat that we can save up in that would be too expensive so we can have some money to save and yeah it's been a bit of a, a nightmare trying to find somewhere that isn't completely disgusting or completely too expensive so we moved from Gibraltar about a month ago now and when I arrived uh, my back threw out so I injured my lower discs in my back and I've been to the osteopath a few times kind of hurt still today but I literally could not walk for about a week then I could hobble and now I can walk around but it still hurts a bit which is just fabulous you know when you've just moved and you want to set everything up so I'm just trying to relaunch my Etsy shop um, add things on there try and send out all the Patreon rewards that have been missed last month um, I'm ordered, I've ordered some more postcards, I want to order more prints and I want to get started on a new comic possibly. I want to do all these things, I'm feeling very inspired being here. We already went to Life Drawing and I got this big board from Craft, Hobbycraft, which is really cool. I thought Hobbycraft was going to be like just knitting stuff but they had loads of art things and I'm really happy to be here to just be able to go to a shop and see art supplies that I want not just like oil paints and kind of more really traditional stuff um yeah I'm just really happy to be here and I hope that you guys enjoy this vlog so let's roll the footage the camera about this when I tried to make ink the guy said to put copper and vinegar in a jar and then um, wait months and it will turn into iron oxide ink it hasn't it's just turned into brown sludge and I've kept this for months hoping that it will turn into a nice ink you know what that might work as ink though that let's try it that would let's try mark. it now that would definitely mark on paper you think so I think so <laughs> Okay, let's see if Chris is right about this iron oxide ink. How do I Not zoom? quite. <laughs> do I... Don't zoom? It doesn't do anything, it's just brown. Yeah, so, it's disgusting. That was a disappointment. We can side though. It. <laughs> Bye. 
goodbye, Gibraltar. Say goodbye. Goodbye, Chloe. Sorry for looking absolutely horrendous, but I just washed my face and we're actually in the, ho the first hotel room now. So it's been a long day of traveling and tomorrow we've got more of it and we're staying in this like hotel with the cats. They like upgraded us for free, which is really nice and kind of them, but the cats are like, ah, our new place of residence. It is now day two and we're leaving the nice room and we're gonna go out to the car and pack everything and see our next journey of seven and a half hours driving I mean Chris is driving I'm not driving so I feel really bad but hopefully it won't be too bad here is the view that we woke up to today pretty nice except it's a bit chilly outside but I think that'll be nice that's Salamanca and we will see it as we drive by it. <laughs> filming we just decided to stop on the side of the road an hour before Bordeaux one hour away and we had to take a picture with the Alcatraz aka the what's it in English what's Alcatraz in English hard <laughs> choke so yeah and uh, Chris is very tired from <laughs> driving toilet break Are they though? Or are they pine cones? <laughs> are you sure they're not pine cones? Now we are in Bordeaux, right? We are in Bordeaux. We're just a minute away from the hotel. Why are you filming me? I'm not filming Kubo, the escape artist. Aye, my little Who boy. managed to break out of his cage. He's passenger number three now. He's like the king of the car now. Can you get that? That's cool. In Bordeaux. Yes, Chris. That's very nice. <laughs> Wait, how'd I, go, how'd I go that way? I have no idea. There, the road, Chris. Signal, signal what you're doing. I'm getting it all on camera. Oh Big. yeah, this looks cool. This looks cool. This looks like Barcelona as well. This looks like Barcelona. Oh. 
Ist nicht. Ist Zeit. <lacht> Okay, we are at our second stop, Bordeaux, and this is our room for the night. We're very happy. We're going to go out and explore the city now because we arrived a bit early, right? Uh, I think we arrived on time, which is a bit good. bit earlier than yesterday, I mean. Yeah, we nine. arrived with some time to spare, which is good. We arrived with some time. Why am I blurry? It's focusing my fat head. <laughs> Stop that. I don't know why I'm blurry. Um, we are in Bordeaux, like I said before, but now we're just doing a bit of like window shopping and um, gonna go eat some food, but it's really cool some of the stuff that we've seen. I don't know why I'm blurry, honestly. You want it it's clear? Amazing. There I am. We've got our masks. Although a lot of people are seeming to be wearing masks here, so I'm a bit confused, but I'll be wearing mine. Um, yeah. Good morning, Chris. Morning, I'm time for my chocos. <laughs> what are you having for breakfast? Show the lid. Melted ice cream. Hard it's not melted. It's melted. Oh. It's in the fridge. Come on. Show the lid of it. We got these and they were like expensive. But they're uh, delicious. I wasn't. They're kind of meh for me, so you can have them. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, I wanted. <laughs> It's completely melted. Ew. Like All right. Sure. We are packing for day three of the drive to the ferry today. It is a rainy day in Bordeaux. Bordeaux. <laughs> I forgot where we were. I was like, <laughs> where, um, where am I? In Bordeaux. As you can see, it's uh, a bit rainy. Actually, it's not too bad. Um, it was super raining yesterday. It was quite nice though in the car driving. Um, this is the view from the hotel, and that's about it. <laughs> packing up. Chris, are you packing or are you eating ice cream? <laughs> well, it's a hard, it's a hard life, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> Royal Majesty. Everyone hasn't got my dad to go into places early. I understand. I'm just admiring your ability to just eat anywhere, anything, at any time. Oh. With a coffee. Espresso. <laughs> Look at all these cats we have, it's ridiculous. Oh, it is well, a bit... I was like, I've got three cats. Yeah, I, I was like, I, I'm really appreciating you right now. When he was like, talking about them and travelling with them. And he was like, I've got a Maine Coon who ripped open the cage like somebody else. Oh, what? Did he? Yeah. You. I, was, I didn't have that conversation with him. I did. We're best friends now. <laughs> Finally, we're getting on the ferry after a billion headaches. Oh, it feels like a dream right now. <laughs> oh, yeah, Had such, an, like uh, such an issue with Kubo. But well, anyway, we're on the ferry now. Hello and welcome to our cruise tour. Chris, can you do a little show for us? We've got uh, here the vanity. Our... We've got okay, here <laughs> the lovely bed with the um, supreme uh, quality duvet. It's a king, Another king, 
Emphasize bed. Emphasize bed, and in here is a lovely toilet and a shower if you need to take one. After the stress of that, I'm just going to walk around the ship for a little bit, take some footage of us leaving, hopefully. Unless they say, Christopher's met and Stephanie's need to get off the boat. <laughs> Don't do that. even an arcade on board. I think Chris will be happy to see this. He's resting in the room right now though. Luigi's Mansion game, pretty lit. I don't know what else is that great. <laughs> What's this? Chris has decided that we are arriving, so we're waiting by the door to get the cats. It has been the worst journey ever. If I look sick, it's because I am. I vomited and it was the worst thing ever. I hate the ferry. I hate it. And don't travel a ferry in a storm. Lesson learned, no? Yeah, I don't know if we hit the storm or not. But halfway, it was the worst swells I've experienced in my life. It was awful. Anyway, see you on the flip side. So we have arrived in Brighton and I wanted to update you guys more but actually I injured my back last week um, so for about a week, our first week in Brighton I've been lying in bed or lying on the sofa really really hurts because I injured like my lower discs on my back from like moving and the stress and everything been seeing an osteopath and things but it's slightly better today settling in now and I'm just about to do some drawing for the first time in probably like a week and a half which is a like that is a long break for me so I'm just gonna be happy to just chill here watch some YouTube do some doodling just to get it out of my system a little bit and uh, Got to reply to some emails, got to do some work, and I've got some work lined up next week, freelance stuff, so busy times, but happy, and we're really glad that we're here, and it's really beautiful, and the weather's a bit crazy, it's a bit um, cold, it was hailstoning, and then it's sunny, it's really weird, um, but we're enjoying it, we're really liking it so far, and yeah, we're here. So, I... Got sent this desk by Flexibot, and I'm gonna check out, check it out. All of the walnut top. Do you wanna see it, Chris? Like it? Ooh, it's great. Massive too. I ordered the walnut top. And this is what it looks like. It's looking really nice. I'm really excited to make it because we have to make it with the other part. This bit uh, is a standing desk, so it's going to be really good. <laughs> Calm down. Calm down. It's going to be really good for my back to be able to stand for a few hours, maybe here and there. Uh, it's really good for your health. So. I'm hoping this helps out. We have to put it together now, so let's go put it together, I guess. Do you like making things? Yeah, I like making things. <laughs> <laughs> this is my excuse, because we're going to share this desk, aren't we, Chris? So, Chris can make it, and I'll film it. <laughs> Why is your hat so tall? I think whoever makes the best keeps it. No, 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 no. Mochi! Mochi! Mochi got to do it. Mochi! 
Moochie! If you think whoever makes the desk keeps it, press one and chat. Be quiet. <laughs> Be quiet. Just don't ask the chat. Don't ask chat anything. <laughs> Live with demons. Hey, Kubi. So, Chris made the desk. Nice job, Chris. <laughs> Let's uh, see it go down. It's got like this. No, don't leave that in. So, it has these options to push it down and up. So you can do it like, oh, it's cool. You can do it like how much you want, or you can just well, keep completely saved, sitting. You've saved some settings or something. Yeah, you you put your own height that you want for your sitting down, and you can press this button and save it to each of these Focusing. numbers. At the moment, I've got this one saved on standing height, so it goes up to like it's not what, I, what I like. Wow, this is really you cool. From here, going up, it's quite nice. What, Chris? Here's me modeling the desk now. <laughs> wow. Ooh, so good for my circulation. Uh, all right, you need to overdo it, Chris. <laughs> so, whilst I've been here, I received a restock of Wishing on a Star, and also I've got the other ones coming. The slow and all at once disappearance is coming as well, 50 copies of each. So I'm going to be restocking that on the site, I think I've already done that. And then I've got some prints coming um, for Etsy but also for my patrons. So those should be arriving soon now that I'm in the UK. Now that I'm in the UK I think everything's going to arrive pretty quick, which is good. Because when I was in Gibraltar, sometimes I was waiting ages. And I found a printer in town, so I think I'll start using them instead. So I can just go there and print out print stickers for Patreon. So everything can get a bit more streamlined with Patreon. So yeah, um, I've got some freelance work today. So I'm working on that today. And then hopefully I can get into more drawing and stuff. I've got my latte coffee and I'm going to get to work. Oh, that Very cool indeed. Open your shop. <laughs> My shop is open, open for, for business. business. So that's the vlog. As you can see, we are settling in. Um, we're trying to do stuff, more stuff. Um, if you guys want any of the prints that I've showed just now, then you can look on my Etsy store because I'm hoping to have them up. Or you can sign up for my Patreon and just let me know which ones you want. Happy to send a few to you if you sign up to Patreon. And um, yeah, I want to get started on making stickers and loads of different things. I am doing freelance at the moment, so it's a little bit difficult, but. I think I should be freed up next week from freelance work so I can be able to work on a few stickers and things. Yeah, um, I'm hoping that it's going to be super fun and I really want to focus on creative stuff and I'm really happy and I hope that you guys are doing well as well. You guys rock and uh, see you next time. Check out my Patreon down below if you're interested.